Hi, Beer Fox here. This time we're going to be having a look at a indie game by a company called Crackshell, um, called Hammer Watch. It's a hack and slash RPG, one of my favourite genres, I suppose. Um, it's one of the Steam Greenlight products, and I believe you can get it on Steam for six ninety nine. It supports multiplayer um, over the internet as well, as you see there. I'm just going to be playing it by myself today to show you this video. Um, if you haven't seen this game before, you probably know about as much as it's about it as I do, really. I've played it about once when I first bought it, and I haven't um, played it since. So let's have a look. So, single player, I'll have it on medium, and um, we'll just have a look at the classes. There's a wizard, there's a ranger. There's a warlock and there's a paladin. I'm going to go with a wizard, I think. So let's have a look. The small bridge broke behind you. There's probably no way out. Yeah. And you can cast magic, but you can't jump over a gap. Oh, fair enough. So that's the... That's the... Uh, it has controller support as well. That's the uh, normal attack. You can see the mana and health down at the bottom. That's a special attack that uses some mana. Reminds me graphically of um, sensible games like Sensi Soccer and Megalomania. Stuff like that back in the day. Brings back some memories, that's for sure. It's a play alright so far. Probably more fun with a few people. A lot of beetles in there. It's like your mana regens over a certain amount of time. Uh, see in the top there, there's keys, various keys you can get in the wall on the right that looks like an anchor. Your amount of lives, I believe when you die, that's your lot. It supports uh, modding as well, I believe. Not that I've tried any of the mods, like I say, I've not played it much at all. But if you like the look of it, you can get it yourself over at Steam. According to perhaps it's running at 149 frames per second, but there you go. Doing very well there, am I? It's a bit squishy. Oh shit. Oh, yeah, where? Oops. Anything special in there? Apart from gold? I don't know, explanation mark. There's an apple there. Hopefully that can. Crap. It's heavily guarded by giant beetles, unfortunately. There you go, 10 health from an apple. Maybe you get more apples and stuff out of. From what I recall, I don't think the levels are randomised in any way. I think they're the same every time. Music's a bit sporadic as well. Uh, it controls alright for this type of thing. Um. There's so much to say about it thus far, really. I mean, it's simple but effective, I suppose. But, oh, ah, yeah. bloody hell. Uh, oh, it's damage numbers. Ooh, what are they? Oh, they're mana crystals. They would appear to be, yes. Some apples. Got them. Sweet. Sweet, crunchy apples. For my wizard. Some of that, you bastards. Nice, oh, it's a key. Oof. It's exciting times. Yep. Oop. Almost like a little treasury. I shouldn't have really wasted my uh, mana just to... So I don't even know where I'm bloody going, but... Ah, yeah, select gives you a little mini-map and shows me as that. I think there's a door down here, actually. Oh, if I get that gold. <coughs> Lest I die of course oh yeah I see that unlocking animation there second to none yeah it didn't actually do any damage to me what's that it's a checkpoint should have known that shouldn't I I thought that was a lever on the oh it's like go mental with your magic to some mana crystals I don't intend to come back this way so So far, I don't know if there's any bosses or anything like that in it. So it's just, oof. And the uh, damage seems to be rather sporadic as well because I've been 
hit by several things that appear to be chewing on me and have done no damage unless there's like an unseen dodge mechanic going on. I don't know if it's that deep really. But it's not looking good for my little red wizard at the moment, that's for sure. 10 health, 20 mana left. It's like watching paint dry, in it? <laughs> Apologies for this video. <laughs> These are bloody hard things to do when you get in a game like this, I tell you. Not knocking it, I'm sure it is. Well, I am, I know. Oh, apples, apples. Get in. Back to full health, but now my manners. Oh, look at the size of that coin in there. But now I've got myself into a bit of. Oh, no. This isn't going to end well. Or is it? If only I could get to those mana crystals. Line up. Line up, boys. Seems to be the way to do it. I don't get any type of experience or anything like that. I think the gold you use, if I remember correctly, you meet NPCs that. NPCs that will uh, give you. sell you power ups and such. Doing better than I thought. Oh, we've progressed to maggots. A plume of maggots, as one of my friends would say. Or a bloom of maggots, perhaps. Can't eat that apple because he's already full. Uh, the music's just weird. Reminds me of like um, Streets of Rage or something like that. It's not fitting at all. I don't know. Ah, oh, three. There, you press E, you can see. 305 gold I've got. Um. Uh, yeah, I have no freaking idea where I'm supposed to be going here. Down here, maybe? Just go where the monsters are, I suppose. Uh, 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 ooh, what, oh, oh, man. Oh, well, that was unfortunate. I was hoping to get at least to the first vendor or something. Stay away from them, they're like boss beetles or something elite. Get on with Oh, are you kidding me? Projectiles? How's that fair? See, this getting messy. So yeah, I assume it's going to work better in multiplayer than it does in single, really. Not going to do much of a job of convincing people to buy this. Not quite sure why I did. Oh, I had a key. I should have known, because I've got a big key to get. Have some of that. I like the bats, they're cool. Look at eyes. Another giant coin over the bridge, which I think I've already got. Can I move the map somewhere? Well, how do I get? Uh, I'm a bit lost, which I always get lost in games. Oh, there's no going up there, through there, I must have missed something. Uh, yeah, something up here. Let's have a look. Apple. Uh, I'm not going to be publishing this video, it's not a very good game. Get the fuck. Oh, gosh. Gosh. Crikey, mercy. There we go. It's a never-ending torrent of excitement, I think it should have on its um, page. Death-defying, heart-stopping, minute-to-minute, oh, okay. It's like, can we, no, uh, obviously not, I have no idea what that blue orb is in there, but I assume it's something very special. Another, have I been here? I've activated that. Into the maggot room. Careful I don't get two shot. Oof. Oh, steady on. I could do with something that gives me mana back on him. And life back as well. 
I think I'm thinking too deeply into it. Something to do with the star over there. Looks like they are very protective over apples. I'll just leave that for now. Ah, shit. Bit of kiting going on. 16 bit kiting, or even 8 bit. Oh, there. Have I got a okay. kite? No. Can't get into that bat room. It's disappointing. It said star, so I don't know what that's a blatantly a foolish thing to do. Uh, that's not bad once you get into it a little bit. There's a bit of risk and reward. Hey, God. It's okay, yeah, then. Oh. Waiting for myself, it would appear. Ah, uh, that happened I had a key. Oh, look at that one with spikes. You don't want to die, does it? It must be an elite, it must be a special one. It's coming for me. Damn, that's a bit of gold. World first, I would have thought. Uh, okay. So it would be nice to find the NPC that gives me power ups, but I don't know if I'm going to do that in this. Oh no, that does not look good, does it? Oh, look at this. There's a lot going on in there. Uh, uh, yeah, that's a good idea. I'll just uh, just trap myself in a room, corner myself. Do those pop then? Oh, you can burst and get it. Oh, shit. Appears I have no kind of potions. I do have a key though. Perhaps I could actually. Oh, look at that. It's a special potion. But there's an elite bug. There she is. Look, you can see her. But we can't get to her. Bet you're on the edge of your seat right now, aren't you? Balls. Oh. Oh dear, that was bound to happen. Let's pop back in. I wonder what that special potion is. Yeah. So there's actually something up there, look, on the map, a little green. Something or is that just that's just the apple, is it? Alright. Oh, well, that's that's depressing. See they hit me then and I didn't lose any now. I did though. Uh, fighting for the apples. Um Yeah. I wish there was something more exciting I could say about this game while I'm doing this vid. It's certainly a challenge. I mean, the video itself, not the game's a bit. I suppose it's a matter of learn if you could be asked, because the layouts are, appear to always be the same, so you just learn the path of least resistance and um, go for it and get your power-ups. I don't appear, appear to be able to run or anything like that dash. I know the Paladin, because that's what I played when I first got it. He, he can dash up. Oh no, wait a minute, I've gone back up. There's a key in there. Oh, good grief. It would be dangerous if I knew what I was doing. Oh, there's traps. Yeah, it includes traps. There's another thing to put on the box. Or on the... Uh, Giant coins and traps are plenty. Uh, pure skill, that. There she goes, there we are, look. Have that. Combo 246 gold. So we've got. Killing 10 enemies in quick succession triggers a combo which increases move speed and damage which I want. Alright, yeah, see. So. Okay, so we've got that. So we're upgraded. So now you've had a 
insight into the combat and the upgrade system as well. So I'm sure you're quite excited by that. So before I finish the video, maybe I can um, pull off a combo and see the first upgrade. So yeah, I think obviously it's going to be a lot more fun in multiplayer than it is by yourself. Um, as even the worst games are. Not that I'm saying it's a bad game, uh, but I think I'm probably going to get killed here anyway. Trying to pull off this death defying. Oh, if only I knew what that special potion did. I'm sure somebody can tell me who's a big... Oh, shit. Well, I think that wraps it up quite nicely. That's Hammer Watch. Thanks for watching. I'm Beer Fox. If you like my videos, please subscribe. I'll see you later.